I could never get in here. <coughs> I guess I have to take that elevator. I hope no one notices. Uh, lovely day, Fred. A lovely day it is. Not many people get this far. It's sort of a test. Someone who gets this far usually puts up a decent fight. Oh, the arena. I don't suppose there's some way I could be more useful to you alive? I don't know. Can you juggle? Well, I could write a lovely poem. I won a prize in school. Nah. We've already got a bad. First. Put your things in that box, but we'll leave you there to starve. Gird thy loins for the moment of truth, for it is upon you. Original. Danny Defoe! You, you've lost a bit of weight. To be fair, you did copy my piece line by line. Who gives a shit, Hastings? A newspaper's supposed to make you feel good. Nobody remembers what they read. I don't want to fight you. The feeling is muted. There's only enough food for the winners, see? Now, let's turn your weapons. Why? It's quite lethal. The other will just give the other chap some bad dreams. Up to you. That padded one doesn't look nearly as effective. How badly do I not want to kill good old Danny? And Danny's picked the lethal one. That's cheery. Hey, tall guy. I've got great odds on you. Don't fuck it up. He's got to come on strong with that lead pipe. You've got to want to block that.
God. Your feet. Twice jumped. You drop his guard. Drop his gun! Sort of vent. I wonder if I can pry it loose. I'd need a jimmy bar. I don't have a j I'm gonna have to search these bodies for bits and bobs of metal, aren't I? Now that no one is actively trying to kill me, I ought to be on the lookout for a motelene dispenser. Oh. 
Boss, I better figure out how to get rid of him real quiet like. Wait. Definitely all the crowd. <laughs> Do we really have to do this? Sorry to bother. Sleep, the poor man's dinner. <coughs> it's been a hard day's night, that was. Oh! 
Why are we doing this to each other? No. I can go to that hamlet and give that chap his medals, and he'll give me the card I need to cross the bridge. All right, now I just need that power seal. Supplemented dimotoly, the fuel of the future now. That's everything I had when they jumped me. If I crouch, I bet I can disappear into those bushes. You're not the bloody hell, are you?
to me that the locals may not be all that welcoming. Uh, hello? Anyone out there? Oh, bloody... Are you a tourist? You're dressed like one. Shit. Slumming it, are we? Must be nice to have a closet. Come in! God, you're new here, aren't you? From the parade? Yes. Well, I... How could you tell? <laughs> yeah. I'll tell you how to survive your next five minutes, and in return you'll give me your socks. Well, that's outrageous! Your funeral? Why are they so angry? Because that suit you're wearing reminds them of all the jolly, proper, decent wellies who drove them out of the homes in the village. And now we're all cold and tired and starving to death. You better get a nice sharp rock and rip that to shreds. My uncle gave this to me for Christmas. Or they'll rip you to shreds. Shit. I hadn't thought there would be so many. Yeah, it's like the latest groovy nightclub, isn't it? People get a bad batch of joy and it like flips a switch. And they can't take joy anymore. So they get chased out of the village. Been a lot of bad batches lately. So what happens if I rip up my suit? They invite me over for tea and biscuits. Then they really won't give a damn what you do. So long as you don't take things that don't belong to you. Or go up and punch someone in the nose. Now you can survive the next five minutes. Cheerio! Nothing personal.
don't think my suit is decent anymore. I could wear it around the garden district, but proper folk will have me pegged for a waste. I got your medals. Thank you. You don't know what these mean to me. To know this sum of this ball. I've got this key card, and I can power up the gate with the power cell. I guess I'm ready to cross the bridge. I suppose he's just another. You won't intimidate. Ah. Welcome to the bloody dog. You're never around here. What a That's waste of time. Irish queen. Ah. Oh. 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 Who will guard the guardians? Oh. Who will guard Let me see. Bloody hell, I'd forgotten about the revolvers. If I go through without taking my joy, I'm gonna get spanked. I'm gonna run like hell when it lets me out. Oh dear. One bridge down, and I'm off to the train station. This is where we hang them, isn't it? They broke into the police station, tried to burn the register so the Germans wouldn't know which kids to take. We didn't want the Germans to be angry, 
did we? We were so scared, or maybe just so tired, so we hanged them to encourage the others. I wonder if we'd made the Germans take the kids by force instead of bringing them down to the station singing London Bridge if things would be different now. I hope that's the worst thing I remember. <coughs> Says the chap heading to the train station. Oh, what lovely memories are waiting for me there. <sighs> At least I can get on the train tracks there and get the hell out of town. No, I just need to find the train station. I want to be able to see it from a... Distance. Jesus. Oh my God. Hold on. No need to get personal. I were a paper mache. I were. Hmm. Uh. Ah. Uh. as grand as it used to be. Of course, there hasn't been a train since the germs left. Still, the tracks go from here all the way to the bridge, and then across the river, and then all over Britain. Oh. I wonder if Prue made it this far. I wonder why Mr. Kite sent her to the Garden District at all. She could have just popped over the bridge from the station at Apple Hole. Try not to blow myself up. Hey, lock up your board bags, I'll piss in your corpses. We're coming for you, you greedy bastard! Go eat a banger, you leaky scanner! You're done hoarding all the V-meat! I feel awful. Not in a nexamide, or failing that some tea to make me throw up. 
the undiscovered country from whose born no traveller returns. <laughs> huh. I feel awful. Murdering the next of mine, or failing that some tea to make me throw. I can't believe I'm still alive. More or less. Ow. How did I manage to crawl back here? Please don't make a fuss.
What have we come to? How do I get down to the trees?
to the tracks. Oh, you know. This won't take a minute. That's how I get down. Right. Huh. Now I just have to find the tracks and walk on out of Wellington Wells. I'm so sorry, Percy. I should have got on the train with you, like I promised. The rule was if a kid was a day over 13, 
What could I do? You could have kept your mouth shut, Arthur, and not told them you were 13. That's what you could have done. to go to Germany, are you not? Please, no! He can't take care of himself! Bloody Bobby. I told him I wanted to board even if I was ten days too old, but we don't make the rules anymore, Mr. Hastings. I shouldn't have told him they got my birthday wrong. I don't even know why I did. Should have just kept quiet and got on the train. Bloody hell, there's been some sort of cave-in. So much for walking down the train tracks to the Britannia Bridge. What the fuck do I do now? Oh look, it's a little lost lamb. Where's Bo Peep? In your curtsy way, I bet. <laughs> That's little Miss Muppet, you Muppet. Uh, uh, can we pound him now? Yep. Uh, uh. Who will guard the guardians? Huh? Who will guard them? You fiend meats. <laughs> You're all fiend meats. We've got to the end of See the violence inherent in the system.
Oh my god, Artie. Shall we do 